green paint left over so I'm going to just go ahead and start with the uh, middle ground back here. It's kind of in shadow. As you come forward there's a streak of where the sun hits it. As you come even further forward this is all shadow down in here also. Okay. Here we go. think it's coming along pretty fast huh he's a big brush um, a lot of paint and you can cover a lot of canvas in a short time <laughs> I have found that to paint laterally sideways like this, especially a really straight line like you're getting in uh, the rails, is very hard to do. So in order to do this rail, I'm going to turn my painting sideways and work on it that way. Because it's, for me anyway, it's much easier to paint up and down. Uh, I, I don't know why, but it's the way that I am, I guess. Um, if I need, I've got what's called a mall stick. Mall stick is a, it's a homemade one. You can pay $30, $40 to have these made, but I paid 50 cents, I think, for a dowel. Wrapped an old sock around it and then uh, put masking tape around that. And all you do is you rest your dowel or your mall stick against the top of the painting. You take your brush and then you can actually rest your arm on it. See how I'm resting my arm? And you can actually slide right down. It just gives you a little bit extra stability. So let's go ahead and get started. Left to do, which is the major part, is the jockey and the horse. So um, I'm going to leave for now and I will see you next time.